वेलकम बैक इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एम गोना शो यू अ लीड मैनेजमेंट वेब ऐप विच इज क्रिएटेड यूजिंग गूगल शीट्स एंड वेब ऐप स्क्रिप्ट सो यू कैन सी हेयर ऑन आवर वेब ऐप फ्रंट एंड वी हैव ऑन द टॉप राइट कॉर्नर आर एड लीड फॉर्म सो वेन आई प्रेस ऑन एड लीड यू विल सी आ फॉर्म इज अपियर विद इमेज अपलोड ऑप्शन विद फाइल अपलोड ऑप्शन so when i uh, make a uh, data for example i will enter the ramiz imdad and email id and also the phone number and the company is a and c and the status is just contacted and the start date is our 21 and end date is not final yet and i wanna to add a picture of this lead so i just add this and click on open and if i have any additional notes i can enter here example i don't have any additional note right now here so i just click on add lead so you will see it will say please wait uh, so we can wait and after completing this process you will see lead added successfully so you can see here uh, the lead is successfully added the latest lead will be shown on the top so you will see the name the email the contact status is contacted and the image of that lead person and the start date is this and date and notes is empty yet so the second function is that the status filter example we have a many leads a lot of leads and i only want to see the new leads so you can see new leads is not available yet and i click on the contacted so you will see the contacted leads i can see easily and also you can see here send demo no one is here lost is here and click on all so here also you can see in our data table we have three action buttons one is view so when i click on the view so you can see this view like this and also you can make a print from them and when i click on the edit icon so you can see you can easily edit your information for example i change the name and uh, i also want to change the file right now this file is uploaded now i want to change to with this file and when i just click on uh, upload and click on update lead so when i click on update lead it will say please wait so we can wait and you can see here the lead is updated and the images is going to be updated so you can see easily and if i want to delete this lead i simply click on click on this delete icon and click on yes delete it so you can see here our lead is deleted successfully so now the date range filter is here finally example we are going to find the leads which is started from particular date to particular date example the leads started from october 21 to october 31st so you can see here the filter data is here and I, if i want to choose the leads from the 1 october and the 2nd october so you can see here so when i am gonna going to refresh my web app so you can see here my data is all here so example if i want to update this negotiate uh, negotiating to complete it convert it send demo conducted lost and i click on the send demo and click on the update lead so when i click on the update lead so you can see here the lead is successfully uploaded and here's the send demo is here also you can copy your data table leads all leads also you can make a excel file of your leads you like this so you can see your excel file will be look like that and you can make a download a pdf or all available leads like this okay and you can also make a print of your available leads okay so this is our lead management web app which have many functionalities the number one functionality is we can add lead the second functionality we can apply the filters on the statuses for new contacted send demo negotiating converted loss okay and we can apply a date range filter on this start date uh, column uh, start date column and also we can if we want to apply the end date range leads we can also apply them okay 
so this is uh, this is the features and here's you can click on view when you click on view you can see this data and you can make a print from here okay so here's uh, when you click on the edit data so here uh, for example this lady will be start on the seven and end on the 22 and uh, here's i will change this to completed okay so update lead when i click on the update lead so you will see the lead is successfully updated and also you can see here the data is successfully updated so this is our lead management web app hope you like it so uh, the last one the question uh, you will ask in the comments uh, here uh, how we can add more drop down options so you just simply go to your index.html and from here you can see this you can add unlimited drop down options as you want also you can add the drop down options here for the filters so this is very easy so you can add unlimited drop down filters here and also here so hope you like this video uh, I hope you like this video my English is not while well. I am just trying to make my videos uh, to make you understandable so when you got this Google sheet link you just simply click on the file click on make a copy when you click on make a copy a copy will be appeared in uh, in in front of your screen and successfully copied in your Google Drive now you just need to click on your extensions and click on the app script and when you click on the app script so you will see the code is already here and the one thing uh, where your file is saved so you will open any folder in your from your Google Drive and from the URL bar you just copy this folder ID and replace here after replacing this click on the deploy click on the new deployment and when you click on the new de deployment sometimes uh, the appearance look like that so just simply click on the setting icons click on the web app here you will must select to anyone and also when you click on the deploy so you can see here the data is uh, successfully deployed now you will get this url and when you copy this url and open in a new window to view your lead management web app and access your data okay so hope you like this video please like subscribe and must comment in our video uh, we make this upgraded version uh, with many more functionalities take care